Go ahead, Rizzer. Rizzer, you had a great game today. Um, Scored two goals. Tell me about it. Well, it was great. Great game today. Um, Rizzer, you had a great game today. Um, Scored two goals. Tell me about it. Well, it was great. It was pretty difficult because the field is very wide and, and like, yay big. So it can, like, tire you out really easy. All right, tell me, what type of training you put in? Because, you know, you're, you're getting better and better every time I see you. Well, sometimes to other people, um, um, you just have to train yourself at home, like working your first touch and things like that, working your controlling, and just hope for the best of it. All right, congratulations. Thank you. No, I have to mention this, uh, Rizzo Jones. I mean, he seems to be developed into a really good player. I, I mean, I've seen him for the last few years now, and he keeps, you know, he keeps getting better and better. What do you guys have to say about, you know, his, his skill? He, he obviously is a, is a, a classman. Uh, uh, for one, I'll say I'm not his PE teacher. Mr. Bean is his PE teacher, but I have been watching him coming up and playing for his clubs. He's developing into a very fine, fine young footballer and fine young gentleman as he is our captain today. So, and he showed it on the field and he shows it off the field. So that's what's most important in my book. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I also have the privilege of working with Rizzo on a daily basis inside the classroom, outside the classroom. Uh, prefect at West Pembroke, you know, great runner on the track, football. Uh, I, I, I must give a lot of credit to his parents, particularly his father, who I see all the time. Uh, he's also helped uh, with the coaching at West Pembroke. So Rizzo has a, a, a good basis, a good uh, uh, parental basis and school basis from which, you know, he can grow. And uh, he's making the best of his opportunities. 